Of course, the only reason that my Twitter stream is a valuable source of learning for me is because I found a bunch of really smart peers who share the same professional interests as I do. And while that can be a challenge for singletons or teachers working in rural communities in real life, it's actually a breeze in Twitter. While the first step that any new Twitter user should take is to convince some of their current peers to join with them, people that you know in real life are always more likely to read and respond to your early messages in Twitter, services like we follow here can be a great place for singletons to find professional colleagues to learn from. Essentially an online phone book that catalogs almost a million Twitter users, we follow can be searched by categories here. That means I can quickly find thousands of Twitter users that are interested in education. I can also find media specialists and band directors and art teachers. Each time I type in a new search term, WeFollow will give me a list of Twitter users that share those same interests. Now, once I find a particular person that I may want to learn from, I can click on their username and get a really short profile describing who they are, sometimes where they're working, and sometimes where they're keeping track of their writing online. If this person sounds interesting to me, all I need to do is click the green follow this user button underneath their icon and their posts will automatically start to appear on my Twitter homepage. The best news about finding users in Twitter with similar interests is that as you start to add followers to your Twitter network, Twitter will start to recommend new people with shared interests that may be worth learning from. That list of recommendations can be found in the sidebar of any user's Twitter page. It's called the Who to Follow list, and it's right here. That list of recommendations, which is constantly being updated as your Twitter network grows, is a simple way to find people who might be of interest to you. Again, I can click on their username to find out a little bit more about who they are. And then I can click on the follow button beneath their picture icon to quickly add their posts to my Twitter stream. That's pretty impressive, huh? Sources like WeFollow and Twitter's Who to Follow feature make it possible for almost anyone to quickly find digital peers to learn from.